The name's Heiji, the frightening Yakuza. Sorry to interrupt, but... I Inazuka? What are you mad at? My very precious car has a dent in it. Do you know anything about it? Not at all. I don't know anything at all. I definitely didn't play catch in front of your car. Hmm, so you played catch. Shit, I, uh, I gotta go. <laughs> hey, come back here! Are you playing tag? It looks fun. Would you like to play as well, miss? No, thanks. As you can see, I'm at the bottom of the hierarchy. I'm always being told off like this. This Aniki's Inazuka. Everyone says he's a demon and is scared of him. But because Miss doesn't have any friends at school, and he was ordered to be her friend by our family boss, I think he recently became a little nicer. I have a daughter. Her name's Hina. Miss is very cute, but my Hina's also super cute. But my ex-wife Kaori won't let me see her. But I guess it can't be helped because I'm in this sort of business. The reason we got divorced was Kaori's affair, but I think she was having an affair because I'm a Yakuza, so I can't really say anything. I really want to see Hina. I've got you now! Look, it's your favorite green pepper. You have to take responsibility by eating this. Please, anything but green peppers. I just can't! Ugh. But my ex-wife is kind of nice to me. She won't let me see her in person, but she lets me talk to her on the phone. So I decided to buy a computer. I'm currently at the electronics store to find a computer. Haven't the slightest clue which one I should get. And they're quite expensive too. Can't buy it with the amount I have on me. I think this one is good. It's cute. Miss? Miss, please. Don't just wander off. Don't follow me. But... Inazuka too? And what are you doing here, Heiji? Ah, well, um... He's going to buy a computer so that he can have a video call with Hina. Miss? How do you know? You were talking to yourself. Was I talking to myself? Yeah. Is Hina your daughter? Yeah, that's right. My ex-wife told me she'd let me have a video call with her. I see. Hey. Eh? What's this money for? Buy the best computer you can with high definition so that you can see Hina's face clearly with this money, alright? Inazuka, thank you so much! Now let's get going, miss. Do you want to go and have a chocolate sundae? I don't feel like it. Oh. These kinds of things are what make Inuzuka so admirable. I want to be like him, and be able to give my Shate money like this when they're in trouble. So I got a laptop right away with the money that Inuzuka gave me. Okay then, I'm gonna go set this up when I get home, and talk to Hina. I got back to my apartment and, is someone standing in front of my door? Hey, how long are you going to make us wait? Inuzuka? Why are you here? Miss didn't want a chocolate sundae, but instead wanted to play Mario Party. Apparently everyone at school is playing it. I see. I bought the game, so we're going to do it at your place. Why my place? Couldn't you do it at your house? I don't have a Switch at my house. Why didn't you buy it with the game? It'll be more fun playing with three people rather than two. Well, yeah, but... Let's play Inuzuka. Of course, miss. Let's go inside. Uh... Huh. Thought I could talk to Hina right away. After that, we played Mario Party for hours. This is actually quite fun. Apparently, you can play online as well, so I might play with Hina. After Inazuka and Miss left, I set up my computer and called Kaori. What's the matter? Hey! I bought a computer! Is it alright if I video call her, please? Okay then, I'll let you do it. Thanks! Finally got the chance to video call Hina, and she even allowed me to talk to her every Saturday! Yippee! I can see Hina soon! It was finally Saturday. Daddy! Hina! It's so good to see ya! I missed you, Daddy! How have you been? I'm good. You've grown so much. Did you know I grew five centimeters? Thanks, Kaori, for letting me talk to Hina. This much is okay. And you stayed away from her even though you wanted to see her, so... Thank you so much. I ended my first call. What a wonderful time it was. After that, I was looking forward to Saturday so much. One Saturday, when I was about to have a video call with Hina, they came. Come out and play, Heiji! I want to play Mario Party, Heiji. It's Inuzuka and Miss. I'll pretend I'm not home. Inuzuka, it seems like Heiji isn't home. What a shame. Actually, I can tell that he's just pretending he's not home. How do you know? I have a feeling. Shit, his senses are super sharp. I should be okay if I keep quiet like this. Okay, Miss. Let's break the door on the count of three. Okay. Huh? One, two, and three! Stop! So you are home. Hi. I'm gonna call Hina now. You can play anything, so just don't interrupt, please! Alright. Does he really get it? Ah well, I ignored the two of them playing Mario Party and called Hina. Hina, did you have a nice day? Yeah, I had lots of fun. I read a book at home today. 
Wow, that sounds lovely. Who are those people? Huh? I'm Mei. I'm Inuzuka. Why are you guys behind me? Hi, Hina. Hello, we're your daddy's friends. Friends? That's great! I didn't even know you had friends, Daddy. I'm always at home, so I don't have any friends. I don't have friends, too. Would you be friends with me, Hina? Really? Yeah. Yay! May and Hina are friends now! Can I be your friend, too? You're different. That's so mean. Hina looks happy. Guess this is alright, too. Never knew Hina would become friends with Miss. I should make more opportunities for Hina to talk to Miss. Hina and Miss became real good friends. And they became like sisters. Wish I could let them see each other in person. I talked to Kaori about it. Hey, Kaori. What is it? Would you let Hina meet Miss? I can't allow that. What? I recently got a boyfriend. I'm going to marry him, so you have to stop calling her as well. How could this happen? Kaori told me I would have to stop the video call soon. The following Saturday, Inuzuka and Miss were at my place again. I'll see you next week, May. See you. Thank you, Miss. Heiji. What is it? Hina didn't look okay. Really? She was smiling, though. She looked like she was having fun talking to you. But she didn't look okay. I'm worried. Wonder what she meant. Was it because I'd have to stop calling Hina? But Kaori hasn't told her that we need to stop the phone calls. Was Miss thinking too much? I told myself it's probably a misunderstanding, or something made myself forget her words. Another week went by, and it was Saturday again. Inuzuka and Miss weren't here today. They could be here any minute, though. Hi, Daddy! Hi, Hina. How you doing? Good! How are you? Great! In that moment, I remembered the words Miss was saying. Hina, are you sure everything's okay? Uh-huh. Um, of course. Did she panic? Hey, can you not say weird stuff? Hina is happy living with me. Right, Hina? I yeah. You were there, Kaori? Of course. I always listen to you guys talk, just in case you say something weird. I see. Look, Daddy. I did some drawing today. Look. Show it to me. What do you think? Wow, you're an artist! Thanks! What exactly did you draw? It's a quiz! Guess the answer! Hina showed me the drawing so that I could see it on my screen. There was a girl on the ground and a man looking over the girl. Maybe she drew me. You're incredible, Hina. It is a little creepy, but I think you have a talent. Next to the drawing were the words, Hello, elephants, lions, penguins. Her handwriting has improved so much as well. That moment... Yo! Mario Party! Mario Party! The two of them came into my room. Didn't I lock my door? How'd you come in? I locked the door! It took a few skills. Inazuka was amazing! What on earth did he do? Oh well, I'll just focus on Hina's drawing for now. Did you draw this, Hina? This is great! Right! But, isn't it a little bit scary? Yeah. Wonder what this is. Why does it have names of animals when you didn't draw any animals? It's a quiz! Try guessing the answer! Hello, elephants, lions, penguins... This is... What are you doing?! Inuzuka suddenly muted the video call. Heiji, read this vertically! Vertically? H-E-L-P? Does this mean... Help? So she wasn't okay. This isn't good. Heiji, try and act normal. Okay. We'll go and rescue her after the video call. We can get there in about 30 minutes if we rush. Yeah. Sorry about that. Accidentally muted the call. You're so clumsy, Daddy. Did you get the answer to the quiz? Well, it's a little too difficult for me. I give up. Oh. Hina made a sad face. Hina made a drawing as well, so look at it. Huh? Mine's a quiz too. She had drawn two men and herself, and next to the drawing were the words octopus, kangaroo, alligator, yippee. The moment Hina saw the drawing, her face brightened up. Did you get it? Not a single bit. It's almost dinner time, so I'll see you soon. See you. And we finished the video call. Thanks, miss. Let's go, Heiji. Yes, we got into the car and headed for Hina's home. Inuzuka, I don't like violence. Everyone avoids me at school because my father is a Yakuza. But I allow you to do whatever. So please, help Hina. Of course. We finally got to Hina's home. We made Miss wait in the car. We sneaked into the garden and looked inside from the gap in between the curtain. We saw something unbelievable. A guy who seemed like Kaori's boyfriend was hitting Hina. And Kaori was smiling looking at it. I'll not forgive him for this. I smashed the window with the steel pipe that I had. What? Huh? Daddy! Hinazuka! We've come to rescue you, Hina! This way, Hina! Heiji, I'll take her to the car. Thank you. Heiji? What the hell do you think you're doing? 
What the hell do you think you're doing to my daughter? <laughs> are you Kaori's ex-husband? You look weak for a Yakuza. Right? You are definitely stronger than him, Kenya. That's for sure. Hina is my punching bag. Don't just steal her from me. Did you know every time I hit her, she screams, Help me, Daddy! <laughs> Isn't that hilarious? It makes me want to punch her more. She's so annoying. Every time I threaten her, saying I'll feed her to the lions, she cries saying, I want to live with Daddy. Feed her to the lions? Oh, well, beat him up, will you, Kenya? All right, then. Hey, do you think you can run? Where are you going? Come back. I didn't run. I went to cut the power. What? I can't see anything. The lights. Turn the lights on. I'm not strong like Inuzuka, so I have to use my brain to fight. I put on the night vision goggles I brought with me. I could very clearly see them panicking. Ah! What's the matter, Kaori? I first tied Kaori with a rope. I tried to tie her boyfriend next, but... You can't come close like this, can you? He started swinging his arms around randomly, so I couldn't get close to him. My eyes are starting to get used to the darkness. Shit, don't have the advantage anymore. I have to fight him now. I grabbed him by his chest, but... Ugh! He beat me easily. How weak. Now let's go and get my punching bag back then, shall we? I won't let you. I bet you're weak too. Ugh! That should do. Inuzuka, thank you so much. You're so weak. You won't be able to protect Hina like that. We need to train when we get back. And what are you going to do now? I have something in mind. Okay, I'll leave it to you then. We drove Hina and Miss to our family boss's home, got some of the members to look after him, and headed to this place. And by this place, I mean the zoo. I thought of feeding him to the lions. Hey, wake up! Uh, where are we? Lions! You'll stay here for the night. You should pray that the lions don't eat ya. I put them in the cage where the lions are kept at the zoo. The lions are usually kept indoors at night, but I made a few phone calls and had them stay out for tonight. Generously put them on a platform, but if they fall, that's the end of them. Help us! Please, forgive us! You threatened you'll feed Hina to the lions, right? Well, it's your turn now. Bye! I also put the voice recorder that recorded them saying they did terrible things to Hina in the cage with them. The next day, the news that people were in the lion cage made the front page. Unfortunately, the two of them were still alive, but they were severely damaged psychologically. They couldn't answer anything the police asked them. They were later arrested because of the voice recorder and Hina's testimony. They're in prison now, but that's not enough. They hurt my daughter. I deliver them pictures of lions every week. A member who was in jail told me that they were crying out loud every time they saw the pictures. Serves them right. After that, I quit being a Yakuza and became a normal person. This was because I wanted to live with Hina again. Couldn't take in Hina if I was a Yakuza. I'm currently working as a normal person, wearing a suit and sweating my ass off while living with Hina and my mother. Inuzuka was the one who introduced me to the job. He's taking care of me so much. Wonder what Inuzuka and Miss are doing right now. Welcome home, Daddy! Hi, Heiji! Yo! I'm using Bowser next! I'm using Mario then! I'll be Luigi! Now I'm siblings with you, miss! Actually, I'll use Boo! Oh. What are you guys doing? Mario Party? That wasn't what I was asking! Come on, Daddy! Let's play! You'll be Waluigi! You look a bit like him! <laughs> okay, let's do it! <laughs> What was all of that emotional stuff for? I'll definitely make Hina have a happy life no matter what. To do that, I need to become strong like Inuzuka. All right, I'll do my best. Uh, am I losing the minigames? Concentrate, Daddy. Sorry. 